Hi, Steve here from photomasteryclub.com and in this quick video I'm going to show you a technique that you can use to add a kind of like a twilight look and feel to an otherwise flat and boring image and so it's a really easy technique to use it just takes uh, one adjustment layer so I will uh, just crack on and I'll show you that now so the adjustment layer that we're going to be working with is selective color so you can add that just down here from the uh, select from the uh, adjustment layers menu and once you've done that what you want to do is just in this drop down box uh, where it's uh, asking us to pick a color we want to choose whites and what this allows us to do it's going to allow us to adjust the amount of uh, cm y and k that is in uh, the uh, the colors of the image already so for example the whites um, what we're going to be doing here is adding a bit of magenta to the whites of the image so I'll just do that now it's just as easy as uh, moving this slider up so as I do that um, I can get quite high on the slider here probably don't want to go too overboard uh, then you'll notice that you know the sky and the mountain tops there have just got a really nice kind of twilight hue to them now so that's pretty cool now depending on the image this might be enough you might want to leave it there otherwise another thing that you can test is uh, with this uh, black slider here you can just darken it as well so the more black you give it the darker the uh, result will become and also you'll notice here that the uh, the sky because it's a bit brighter and a slightly different tone to the reflection the reflection hasn't actually taken on any of this purple tone which it should have really if you know we're going to pass this off as a realistic image so what you can do then is you know, in this case um, I'll look to change the uh, the blues or the cyans I'm not sure which one it will be yet let's try the blues so you basically want to pick the color whatever uh, you know, whatever your foreground is made up of if uh, if it's a reflection it's probably going to be blues because it's reflecting in water I would imagine so let's go with the blues and let's add a bit of magenta into there as well and that probably just about does it that looks quite good maybe let's see if we can darken it a bit I um, don't really need to so um, yeah, so that's it really. I mean, there are of course other ways that you can uh, do this and affect the color balance in the image, but this is just a really quick and easy way. Um, if you have an image like this, which is quite flat and boring, just completely dead light really, uh, you know, just turn it into something a bit more punchy and exciting uh, and nicer to look at. Now, if you like this video and you can see yourself doing more uh, with Photoshop, just like this, and you know, you want to really learn how to take your images to the next level uh, in Photoshop and in your post processing Lightroom, Photoshop and whatnot then click the link below this video and you can get on the waiting list to join the Photo Mastery Club membership so uh, in there we've got heaps of courses and uh, cheat sheets and we've got a forum and there's personal one-on-one -on -one coaching with me so you know this really is uh, designed to help you, you know, reach your goals with your photography whatever it is that you're setting out to uh, to achieve with that so like I said just click the link below this video and get on the waiting list and I will let you know when a spot opens up but for now thanks for watching and I'll see you next time